Mary Jo Kopechny was a very dedicated uh, campaign worker for Bobby Kennedy. She even types up his uh, one of his speeches to, when he declares um, his run for the presidency, something she was incredibly proud of. So even though at the time the women were sometimes called secretaries or assistants, uh, they were true campaign workers in charge of states uh, and delegates for the election. And, uh, you know, they worked, uh, they said, 24-7. Remember that there were no copy machines, there were no cell phones, there were no computers, and these girls had to do a lot of physical labor to get their job done. Mary Jo, for instance, was sent to Wilkes-Barre, Pennsylvania. She was to set up an event that Bobby was going to come to to address the people of Wyoming Valley. Wyoming Valley is a solidly coal mining community, and they're hardworking. And she had to design the setup for his visit. And they had chosen uh, the front of one of the um, department stores. He would address the people from there, because across the street there was the city square. And Mary Jo backed up and she said no. She said, look down Market Street, right to the uh, Market Street Bridge and beyond to the valley. She said, you set him up here and he'll have this vast um, panorama of people that's a better shot for him and for the event. So she was giving those kinds of responsibilities um, from Bobby, and so were the other girls. They all had their own things to do. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel, and don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.